Uh, I said that I feel like we've been through so much adversity this year that that's really nothing at this point. Uh, we just got to keep coming together as a team because we're getting closer and closer, and we just got to keep working and getting better every single day. I mean, it always feels good to help the help the team, you know, win and to contribute, you know, be a part of the win. I just, you know, try to do whatever I can, you know, to help the team and put us in the best position. Obviously, y'all, y'all are pretty depleted in terms of roster right now. Coach talked a lot about the guys who kind of chose to stay invested and chose to hang around. I guess how nice a reward, is that the word, I guess, was tonight just with what the last couple of weeks have been like? Oh, uh, it's the best feeling to win. That's what we're out here to do every single day is to win and just get better. It was definitely all the hard work's paying off, so, you know, it's showing. For either one of you or both of you guys, what was it like after the last month to just get out here again, have a uniform and be in the stadium and, and, and have a, a game to play? Go ahead, bro. <laughs> um, it's a great feeling to get out on the field and play football. It's been a while. Um, just getting out there with the boys and uh, competing like that and having a great game like that was really special, but we have a lot of improvement and a lot of things to work on. Most definitely. It's always fun to, you know, get get with the boys and play football. You know, that's the best feeling ever. All right, we're going to Brendan, 24-7. Jordan, what did it mean to see Lawrence, Jakai, you know, Treshawn, some, some younger guys get this involved in the offense and then step up when their number was called? Oh, it was great watching that. It's a great feeling just know, looking next to you and just seeing those guys and knowing how much talent they have. It's a really special feeling. And just handing the ball off to them and let them do their work is awesome to do. And it's a great feeling for me that I could just hand the ball off and kind of relax. We saw the, the team reaction when Hamza made the interception. It, it seemed like a really big team moment. Is he someone, obviously, he's the, a veteran, he's a team leader. You know, y'all are on the same side of the ball as him. Is he someone this year he's really looked at as an example of how to kind of stay invested even when things may not be going your way? Most definitely. Every time I see him, he's working hard just to, you know, get back to himself and, you know, be able to play football with us and stuff. And right now he's been improving very well. and. It's just so happy. Like, I'm happy for him, you know, that he gets to play and he got a pick, you know. It's just always all good things. Going to Ira. With the uh, six rushing ta- touchdowns and the 300 rushing yards, how, I mean, obviously the offensive line must have played pretty well. Um, but, but with guys moving around, uh, I guess how impressed were you guys with how the line played? Uh, I'm so impressed with them. I'm so thankful I have them in front of me. Uh, a lot of guys had to step up this week. We had a lot of guys down and young freshmen stepping up and making big plays and making big blocks and just going out there being confident. It was a great feeling and I look forward to keep working with the boys in the future. Most definitely proud of the whole line.